Cause you make me feel like I've been locked out of heaven for too low, oh, oh, oh. for too low, oh, 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 I went to public property and they got me bump, 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 bump. All I was doing was walking and recording, recording. But these pigs take me to cages and these pigs take me to cages and this guy is after my own heart. I make this up as I go along because pigs make me feel like I live in a police state. What's up, everybody? Here's a video I just got done watching on Nate Skate's channel. The guy's name is Innocent Auditor. And he's a man after all my, all my own heart here. Except he's a lot calmer than me until the end. Which, whatever. These cops, everything he said to them, that they deserve and more. Not only that, they sh themselves committed several felonies. Oh, cops, run. Up until this point, he walked down he's walking down a public road there was a gate this is like a public works area uh for the city and the gate was open there's nothing that said no trespassing so for all he knew he was just on in public well uh, when you see the end of this you'll know that he was in public oh so he walked around he recorded a police car whose driver's side window was wide open and the shotgun was in there and the laptop was in there and a set of handcuffs were in there um and he was just walking around recording stuff and not up until now in the video did the cop make a u-turn and now they've decided that uh free americans aren't allowed to walk around in the buildings and infrastructure they pay for oh no Stop. Stop. Stop and respect my costume. You got my on you? For what? Trespass. First thing in his out of his mouth. Can you please surrender your Fourth Amendment right to me because I'm in a costume? That's how you treat the public? You wonder why there's a divide. First thing out of your mouth is asking somebody to surrender their right to privacy. There's no trespass signs. Can you show me? Do you have an ID on you? Where's the trespass sign? Not gonna it with you. I'm not going to discuss it with you. I decided that I'm going to hem you up, and that's it. Inform me of your trespass first. You can't say, hey, you trespassed, and you leave. Because you give me an opportunity to leave. The other alternative in the law book says that if there's things Show me. obviously designed to Show me. Out. Oh, no. He has to be signage. There's going to be signage. Be supervisor. D. Marshall, you have your badge number? 1117. 1117, D. Marshall? So we need signage up, or we need to be told to leave. This is all public. Uh, public. This area is not public. Sure it is. It's totally fine. We're on the admin building. This is just, I noticed they huh? need to go beyond the gates to the north building. Huh? That's perfect. That's exactly huh? right. This gate is designed to do the same thing. Unfortunately, it has to be curved open for trucks to go back and forth. We need signage. I'll show you. Come on, come walk with me. I'll I'm show you. Walk with you. You stay here. Oh, really? I'm being detained? You're being detained. Okay. I have reasonable suspicion to believe that you're trespassing. So I need signage. Reasonable suspicion to believe he's been trespassing? First of all, there's nothing reasonable about you. Secondly, where'd you find this reasonable suspicion? Because you obviously have never read the trespassing law. You've just been enforcing it the way your uh, booty pucker wants you to. And people just respect your costume. But when you find someone that actually has read the law and doesn't respect your costume and goes by your character instead, now you turn into an idiot, an imbecile. I need some. I don't have idea on me now. Nope, I refuse. I'm not, I'm not trespassing. So, you understand, you ought to be told I'm trespassing first, right? Or they're asking me something. What is that? To keep people out. Tell me what it is. What is it? I see no gates. Gates. I see no gates. Gates at the north end of this main lot. So, you're telling me this? The gate that was wide open with zero signage on it. This sheriff's office right here is in public? It is not. I can't walk in this public? No. Really? That's correct. Wow. It's 
out of sheriff's office. It's what is it? It's a plea building? For us so to change our car. It has nothing to do with The one that says sheriff's office on it? Public. This whole area is closed. So you're public. telling me. You're currently trespassing. You your ID? I'm not going to leave my ID. Okay, first name and last name. I'm not going to leave my ID. You don't have to arrest me. We have to book you in jail? I mean, I'm not doing anything against the law. Okay, well, for now, we're going to detain you until we can figure out who you are. Okay. So we're going to abduct you against your will, even though you've done nothing to no one, and you're literally standing on property that you pay for as a tax paper. And, uh, where am I at? Midville? Midville, right? Midville, Midville Utah. Salt Lake County Sheriff's Department. Uh, Deputy Shattuck, you have a badge number? Yes, 11. Okay, so I'm simply asking where the trespassing signs are, and where it says it's not open to public, where these are all public buildings. Is a public truck? Is a public truck? Public truck, public building, this is all a trash waste area. I'm a first time auditor, and if you want to go down this road, we can. Step over here, Warren. Right. Back to the car, All right, if we're unlocked, you can just step in for me. You got any weapons on you? You got any weapons on you? I haven't violated any laws. Perfect. Go ahead and step in the car for me. I haven't done anything wrong. I'm being put you in the take vehicle. Your backpack off if it doesn't fit. Hold it on your lap, whatever's huh? best for you. All right. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Try to roll the window down for you. Thank you. Yeah, Chat, I'm arrested. I'm not That's not claustrophobic at all. Questions? Yep, I need a lawyer. Hey, uh, uh, Utah Cop Watch, will you call my wife? There's no trespassing signs anywhere. It's all public area. You haven't given me a chance to leave. They didn't ask me to leave. I would have left if they told me to. Simple as that. Uh, they asked for my ID, but they didn't tell me the law I broke in. No trespassing signs. I mean, there's nothing there. There's no trespass anywhere. No trespassing. So that's all, you know. I'm being kidnapped right now, chat. I'm being kidnapped right now. 100%. This is a kidnapping. Abduction. Currently being kidnapped. I'm literally in the back of a police vehicle right now. I'm being kidnapped. Start calling, yeah. Don't talk. It's okay. I didn't see any signage, and they didn't give me a chance to leave, so they're, they're literally having some big issues. This is a lawsuit for the sheriff's department. I mean, hey, you know what it is, you know? It's a lawsuit. All they had to do was say, hey, this is private property. I mean, there's no signage. You need to leave. I'd have left. But nope. That's fine. Whatever. I am literally being kidnapped, yes. I, I have plenty of witnesses, yes. I have no idea. So, I mean, they got asked for the supervisor. They haven't called the supervisor down. So, now we're here. So, if you want to share this video and get it out so I have some more help, it'd be great. This thing is small, yo. So, now they preemptively kidnapped, abducted this guy. Now, they're both going to get out of the car and try to figure out what to do instead of figuring out what to do beforehand knowing the law beforehand knowing how to make the food you know like i say a, a cop not knowing the law is like a chef not knowing his recipes you don't know your recipes you make garbage and you serve garbage to the public and that's what police serve up every day ignorant garbage What have I done wrong? They said there's trespassing signs, there's gates designed, but there's no, I mean, I looked at the gate, there's nothing there. So, I mean, I'm literally being uh, kidnapped right now. Can I get some water? I'm thirsty. Do you got any water? Yeah, 
Yeah, please share this video. I need help. Everybody share this. Subscribe to Innocent Auditor. I'm scared, actually. These guys have guns, and they're not being very nice. Yeah, their signs must be posted with code. There was nothing there. As far as I know, I saw a police station, a UHP, or a, a sheriff department. And uh, uh, they took me to oh, Public Works. That's where I'm at. I'm at the Public Works UTA building. Uh, the number is 801-743-7000. 801-743-7000. I didn't even realize they drove him to a public works building. What is the point of that? Damn it, Terry. <sighs> hey, Leslie. I'm in the back of the police car right now. Um, I don't know what the hell's going on. So. Yep, he's patting me down. That's for the weapons. I don't know. So, yeah, these are one. Keep posting that. Keep, get this video out, man. I need help. I'm going to fast forward just a little bit. No, I'm not. It's right at the right spot. Help. I'm being kidnapped. Help. I'm being kidnapped. Help, I'm being kidnapped. Audit, the audit says that you shouldn't do stuff like this because it could put police officers' lives in danger. So, he's literally being abducted by police for breaking no laws. And he's saying, I've been abducted, I'm being kidnapped. And audit, the audit says people shouldn't do that because it could put officers' safety in risk. The, the, you know, the officers that kidnapped the guy here. Help! I'm being kidnapped. I'm being kidnapped. Help. And of course, just like Wolf Boy and the cops yesterday on my video, they, they arrest you. It's like shoot first, ask questions later. They abduct you first, illegally abduct you off the street, which is a felony, unless, unless you're wearing a costume, of course. And then they drive to some irrelevant place and get out and start calling somebody hoping that they were right. How about you just be right the first before you make contact, know what you're talking about. Because then you can't do what you want. That's that's the issue. They want to do what they want regardless of what the law says. And that's why, by definition, textbook definition, they are the sovereign citizens. Anyone who says otherwise is an imbecile, bar none. Help! Help! You know, the first room is a beautiful theme. This is all public works, all public area. There's no sign saying you can't be there. They didn't give me a chance to leave. This is bullshit. Now I'm being literally kidnapped right now in the vehicle. So... I'm not sure what his name is. Just tell me out, guys. Get this video out. It's like that. Call Tom Wood or something. It's fucking crazy, man. Literally back of the fucking police car right now. They're filming. It's unbelievable. And it's crazy. Step out. Uh. Oh, shit. You're here by trespass. Okay. Have a nice day. Can I tell you something? You're here by trespass. Have a nice day. Where's his paperwork? I thought you were going to ID him. I thought he was already trespassing and you were going to give him a citation. The reason he's saying it verbally is because he probably doesn't have uh, the jurisdiction to trespass him from there because it's probably public. And that's why he's doing it verbally. And watch how he ignores him for the rest of the way. And when he asks for a supervisor, they do just like they did yesterday. Go inside, lock themselves in the building like the cowards that they are. This is a coward right here. Here's the thumbnail. Diaper-faced coward. This is so sick. How in the world? 
Imagine you abducted somebody right off the street. And then and then when you find out you're wrong, you're just like, oh, okay, you're good to go, but just don't go back there anymore. Have a nice day. Fuck you, you piece of shit. Fuck you too. And both your disgusting mothers. Fucking kidnapped me for no reason. You learn the law, huh? Fucking piece of shit, motherfucker. Fuck you. I'll see you in fucking court, motherfucker. I'll see you in your court. Yep. Gonna have your badge, buddy. Gonna have your badge, buddy. Fucking piece of shit with a gun. Fuck you. Hope your kids and wife love this shit when they see it on fucking internet. Fuck you. That that's the that's the great thing about this. In the future, because these videos aren't going anywhere. Your kids, this is what they're gonna see. They're gonna see that you kidnapped a man off the street because you're a stupid fuck. Fuck you! Fuck you! I want your supervisor! I need you. Now they're gonna pretend like they can't hear him. When it's time for them to be held accountable, they lock the doors, turn their backs, and pretend like they can't hear you. Supervisor! I need your supervisor! Hey! I need your supervisor now! Marshall! I need your supervisor! I need your supervisor. What do you not understand? I need your supervisor, you fucking cunt. Fuck you. Man, they were so aggressive before. What happened? What what changed? Man, we need audit the audit to explain this to us. Unfucking believable, man. Fucking clowns. Fuck you guys. Fucking unbelievable. Holy shit. Oh, I'm shaking. Hey, Mr. Potato. Woo! All right, go watch the whole video on Innocent Auditor's channel. Please subscribe to Innocent Auditor. Tell them I sent you. I'm not going to cut bleep out anything. I'm going to leave it the way it is. Thanks for watching. Peace, tranquility. John's coin rings. Love you long time. Have a good night. Have a good day. Tomorrow I'm going to Reunion, Florida. Uh, my friend who plays pool, who also happens to be a doctor, has this huge home in Orlando. He invited us out. I'm going to marinate some pork and maybe get some octopus. Grill it on the grill. Swim in the pool. He's got a pool table there. And free golf in the morning. It's going to be fun. Boys night out. Whoop, whoop. We might order some Hordash. Just kidding. <laughs> Hordash.